man. You know I'm stopping you, brother. A couple different reasons here. Sort of money ain't got activated. Sort of money ain't got activated. Saw that money ain't got activated. I saw that money ain't got activated. What is up, guys? Welcome back to another video. This video is gonna be kind of fast paced because uh, we already got what we're doing kind of already set up. So um, the Cummins is about to be ridiculously wide. So I'll kind of show you guys what we got going on here. This video is gonna be all over the place. I'm supposed to go this big meet, probably the last meet of the year, so I wanna film it. Other than that, that's pretty much it. Okay, so we got these bad boys here for the rear. That should get us level with the front. Should give us, that's about what it's looking like right now. So uh, I already got most of the lug nuts on the side, had a good new battery. Let's get these bad boys on. All right, update. Trey's a fucking slow bitch. And he's raising. It just took forever to get changed. I've been here. No, it's because exactly. I put I put Dumb on bitch. a shirt. Exactly. I put on that one shirt, and I realized there was too much foam I'd bring on a hoodie. it. It's gonna get cold. No, I do have a hoodie in the truck. Uh, but yeah, that's blame Trey. Box. Blame Trey for why we're late. Okay. Make sure you get me. Make sure you get rollers, Trey. Can't. Yeah. Yeah. All right, boys. So we're finally at the meet. This is the first meet I've vlogged this year. Look at little pussy. You. Uh, yeah, so we got the actual spacers on. I'll show you. Pretty freaking fat. Pretty freaking fat. I'd say that they're like, they're literally perfectly level. Although the front still looks I like wider. Looks fatter than me. Looking at it from right here, it looks the same. Probably close. It is close, but if you look at it from the back, the back definitely looks fatter. Yeah, it looks sick. I was looking at it in your driveway. I was telling Lucas, I was like, I think he might have been an inch off. I don't think so. I measured it. So, dude, it's. I feel like. I feel like I need to have a camera right now because it's so awkward with a phone, dude. It is because everyone's, everyone's, everyone's like, like, look at this fucking dumbass. Who's this wannabe fucking vlogger? No, no, no. If you have a camera, people are like, oh, okay. Dude, this is what we need in the hard body. Oh, look. It's got flames, bro. Yeah, that's what we need for sure. Imagine the hard body had a 2JZ in it. That'd be baller. Look at them pie cuts, bro. <laughs> Lucas, remember this? Are you a fucking panda? <laughs> I thought I said fuck you that time. <laughs> Lucas, bro, why'd you call the cops? Fuck them, bro. <laughs> dude, whose stretch tire donk is this, dude? I don't know why it looks cambered right now. It's because the wheels turn. Yeah, it is. Because earlier today at work, the wheel was straight and it didn't look cambered, so. I'm just gonna be honest. I need content. I need to like run somebody over with my truck or something. Cresta. Oh, it is a Cresta. I went away. Oh. Okay, guys, so this video is really not, you know, all that great, like... He's a shitty YouTuber. No, I'm just not, like, good at... Like, when you come out to meet and stuff, like, you're just really talking to people, so, like... There's not really anything lit or cool that happens at our meets, like... Like, the meets in, like, Florida and, like, California and shit, they be doing donuts, drifting, all kinds of crazy stuff. Everybody here is just retarded, honestly, so... That's kind of the gist of it. Unfortunately, hopefully something lit will happen so that way we can have a little bit of content for this video If not, you guys are just gonna have a boring video to watch
expired tags. They expired? My tags are expired, yeah. But I ordered registration tags online and they've just been taking forever to get in. Mm -hmm. So, as long as I have proof, I don't think he'll give me a two or a time. But he's definitely probably calling back up because he's sitting there for a hot second. What's going on, buddy? Not too much. How about you? Oh, uh, living the dream, man. You know I'm stopping you, brother. Oh. Uh, a couple different reasons here. All right. Here. You only have one working tail light, one working oh, brake really? light. You yeah. need to have at least two brake lights. You need one tail light to drive. Yeah, I didn't know it was out. Yeah. Well, yeah, you only have one working okay. back here at all. Okay. okay. Oh, there's only then, one working, you're saying? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, one working at all. And then um, it's coming back to a red dog. Yeah, the truck is, was, so I, I just ordered plates and everything for the truck, okay. so th it, that would be updated. But okay. it was red, yes. Yeah, so you can see right here, it's red. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, yeah it's just, you just it just it. got painted. Yeah. All right, cool. Were you having some issues over there on the side of 16? You couldn't get it. Yeah, no. My ignition right here <laughs> was smoking. We were driving down the road and it started smoking, okay. so we pulled over to check it out, and I cool. pulled the column off. So all it's right, all good now. I but... get it, man. I get it. You got your license, registration, proof, insurance on your brother. Uh, yeah. All right. Now my registration will probably show as old because I just I all my registration stuff just got ordered. Yeah, I have yeah, proof yeah, of it. Yeah, it came back good. Oh, it did? Oh no, I think I think it did come back. License plate was expired. Yeah, I just ordered all of it, so you have usually. Proof of that stuff? Yeah, I do. I can I can actually get yeah, that for you. you want to grab that for me too, buddy. Yeah, it's just on my phone. So you want to hand me? It's actually kind of a mess. <laughs> I should have this stuff organized, but. Turn this light on here. Jeez, dude. Yeah. This truck's been parked for a long time, so everything's kinda. Alright, I get it, bud. Uh it should be let's see. Doesn't look like the thing in here. Yeah, it's 2019. Here's Where are you guys from? Columbus. Columbus. Yeah. Going out this way? We were just out here at the the newer car meet. They okay. have they have they host like a big meet once. A uh, couple. That's license registration, and then. Oh, is that your phone? Yeah. Where's yeah. my phone? Yeah. And then I'll pull up that email. Well, guys, I literally said I need content. I need to get pulled over, and here we are. Okay, so I know you guys. I didn't. Lucas had my phone, and uh, he didn't record the last half of the conversation with the cop. So I'll kind of just go through what happened. Um, so pretty much he kind of just like came back to the, or he, I, my tags were expired and I had a taillight out and the tags came back to a red Dodge, which my truck used to be red. Um, and I've never changed it, I guess. I didn't think it was that big of a deal. Um, but he pulled me over for a taillight and the fact that my tag, he didn't even know my tags were expired until I said something, which, I wasn't worried about because I ordered new registration and new tags and stuff. Um, so, and I have proof of, you know, purchase and stuff. I'm just waiting for it all to come in the mail because I got custom tags. So I showed him that he, he was like, I'm giving you a warning regardless, even if you don't show me proof of tags, he was like, I'm a car guy too. So I get it. Like you probably didn't know the tail light was out or whatever. So he's like, either way, I'm giving you a break. I just got to check your license make sure everything's good. Um, and because it, we were actually pulled over on the side of the road because something under the column was smoking. It ended up being there was a wire grounding out on uh, something under the column. But, like, he saw us pulled over and, like, went to do a U-turn on the freeway. But we started to pull away as he was doing a U-turn. So, like, he followed us up the on-ramp and then sat at the light with us. And then as we turned left, he pulled us over. So, he was actually really cool. It goes to show that not all cops can be dicks. He was being super chill. He could have definitely gave me a hard time, especially with what having expired tags and having a truck that's obviously pretty ignorant, you know, tinted windows, wide wheels. There's a lot of things that he could really just been a dick about that he wasn't. So like, and I would have more, been more than happy to pay a ticket. You know, I knew that the brake light was out. It was just something I kind of forgot to replace before we went. So like, it's one of those things that like, I would have been fine with paying the ticket. Like he's not wrong for pulling me over. Like he's got to do his job and enforce the law. And, you know, by driving something that I drive, I 100% make that choice. You know what I mean? So, like, a lot of people will bitch and complain, like, oh, I got pulled over for window tent and got a ticket. That's bullcrap. Like, 
you tinted your windows, you knew the consequences of tinting your windows. Like you can't be mad at the cop for doing his job. So I 100% support law enforcement. Um, but to an extent, I guess there are cops out there that are not good and there are cops that are racist. There are cops that, it's just like any other profession. There, there's every profession you have, there's gonna be racist people. There's gonna be people that are assholes. It's just, you can't put them all under the same category. So this goes shows that, you know, cops aren't all bad. Like that cop could have very well given me a hard time. He could have towed my truck home, honestly. He could have had my truck towed, put it in pound, put me in, you know, there's all kinds of things that he could have done, but didn't and was willing to give me a uh, warning, you know, and the fact that he said he was a car guy too and had ton, he has tons of his own projects and stuff. So he was understanding, so. Just keep note of that guys, um, you know. And again, remember, I do understand that some cops are assholes. There are cops that kill, you know, people for no reason. It, the world's messed up and um, you kind of just can't categorize people in, all in the same categor category anymore because, you know, everybody's different. So with that being said, that's gonna be it for this video, guys. I know it wasn't a huge, you know, content filled video, but we kind of got put in a little bit of a small situation where like couldn't really work on the hard body because parts aren't in for it and the part that you know i'm filming on planning on filming for the hard body or for the cummins doesn't come in tomorrow so we kind of got a last resort of you know just filming a kind of a boring meet and it's funny because we were at the meet and i told trey i was like man i need to get pulled over on the way home or something so i have so i have a good content for a video or something but and it seems like every time I mention getting pulled over, I get pulled over. So that just goes to show that's 100% true. So anyways, guys, um, I'll see you guys in the next video. The next video should be either the Cummins or the hard body. Most likely the Cummins or hard body because we have about less than 20 days to have it ready. And we've got a lot of work. So stay tuned for that, guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. Deuces.